guys, Connor here, um, today I'm going to be doing the episode 3 I believe of the platform series. So we'll be on to the player class today. So, what we need to do is import static org.lightjumpgmail.gl.gl11.star it's a little bit laggy because I'm recording. Eleven dot star. Right. So we need to make some variables, which will be public doubles. Um, X public double. Y public double. X speed. Y speed. Um, I've got a GitHub repository for this game now, so pro the link will probably be in the description. So, let's make a constructor. And um, set x is equal to 100 y is equal to 100 and x speed equals 1 yeah so now we're going to be <coughs> public void draw so gl push matrix um, gl translated X, Y, 0. And now, good old friend, GL begin. GL. Quads. Uh, good braces. GL color 3D. 1, 0, 0. Don't know if I already said this, but the 3D stands for three doubles. I see. So, that looks nice. so GL color 3F will be three floats. Um, gel vertex 2D, two doubles, minus 8 and 0. So um, gel color 3D, 0, 1, 0. Gel vertex 2D, 8, 0. Gel color 3D. And then we do zero zero one, and then gel vertex and gel vertex two D eight sixteen. Um, I am using my old keyboard because I can't get used to the razor one, so I'm using that from the Xbox now. Right, Geo Color 3D. 1, 1, and 0. Vertex 2D. Minus 8, 16. Geo End. Oh, I need to do that outside of the code braces. Geo End. And then. Geo. So, that's that. So now what we actually need to do is go into game. Oh, where's my mouse? Here. So, we need to go public player player. And then, the player equals new player. And then here, when it says draw background, oh, and I'm public static player player. So then.
Wow, that's not. We can just go player dot draw. So it will draw the player. Right. So now we need to make the logic public void logic. Um, x plus equals x speed. X speed. Y plus equals Y speed. And then let's just put Y speed equals plus equals. Actually, yeah. Because then it'll need to be in there. Right. So then we'll have to go if y is less than or equal to 32, y speed equals 0, y equals 32. Alright, so I'll just let you catch up with that. Right, okay, so now we should have the player being drawn to the screen. Play. Oh, run. Oh. Right. Yeah, I forgot you have to, I have to do it from here. Right. So there. is not there, how come? Right, okay, so turns out I need to do that after I draw the background. <laughs> right, because then it was drawing the play, then it was drawing the background. So there we go, that's the player. Now it doesn't move at the moment, so we're just going to have some basic manoeuvring. Then we, then we just call logic. Simple as that. And just call that. And then game run. And then pop onto my other monitor and it went like that and it's moving so that's basically collision detection so let's just add something so else if x is less than or equal to 120 as you know it's just 50. There we go. X speed equals 0. X equals 1. Let's just pull that. Let's see what happens. Right. Okay, so. Let's go off the screen like that. So we've got the player drawn. In the next episode, uh, in the next episode, we will be doing rules for the actual player. So thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, make sure to rate, comment, subscribe. Bye. We need to get rid of this there we go